I don't come again on this channel. This one now, Victory Hot News. I see they hot now. They bring them more. If you're just joining us, please do subscribe on this channel, like our videos. Finally, I want to know who these Ohanes and Debo people. I don't. I want to know who they are, because now them be the problem where we they get for Southeast. What did they talk? Give you Roban now, and the APC government said they go do my say, but now they make me. Are they vex? Are they vex? I don't understand. They say, why you not no fit arrest this guy? He's a terrorist in Finland. No, na just deliver. Na make it the issue citadel order in Lagos. They, that this one na joke taken too far. I can't they wonder what thing they talk give MC Olomo and the Agboro people and the governor of Lagos and Tunubu. We allow their people. They born. Um, ballot balls destroying a lot of things and now after election they still have the audacity to burn Igbo market oh, and there's a no talk go that side though because they no ever want to get problem with APC then they collect money woto woto for their hand then they collect enough envelope from there that's why they know they talk go that side waiting they talk now and I go read give you you go shock um, Hannes Adibo blast Simon Eba for issuing sit at home order in Lagos. The body secretary general Okechuku Isiguzo described the order as reckless and a joke taken too far. The Hannes Adibo worldwide has lashed out at Simon Eba for issuing sit at home order in Lagos State, according to the body secretary general Okechuku Isiguzo. The order is reckless. He noted that Epa opted for a fratricidal war between Igbo and Yoruba over his inability to stop the Labour Party. LP presidential candidate Peter Obi's victory in the Southeast. The Ohanese chieftain blamed the Nigerian government for Epa's continued action, stressing that the inability to arrest the alleged international terrorists was responsible for the order. <laughs> in, a while, in a statement, Isi Guzoro said, after failing to do his paymaster's bid of causing vote, voter apathy in the Southeast with the landslide victory of the Labour Party LP presidential candidate Mr. Peter Obi in the region, he appears to have been given a new assignment by his puppet master revocation of the Factory cedar war between the Igbo and their Yoruba siblings. Wow. We blame all that on federal government that is surprisingly treating his international terrorism with kid gloves, thereby giving him the temerity to cause more havoc from his safe heaven in Finland. Epa and his gang are responsible for the death of scores of innocent citizens and security personnel in Southeast and should be extradited to face the full wrath of the of law of terrorism. Now wait till Hanese they talk oh they no talk go the side of where they supposed to talk go. Hmm? The kind of leaders we have in these days. Wonders they say shall not end. You know go better for them. Because we must call a spade a spade on this channel. You, any of you, any of these people that are doing this thing for their selfish gains, somebody is paying you, somebody will give you money, somebody has promised you money, and therefore you come on air to say you are representing a region. You know go better for you. You know go better for your children. Now so it be. Ah ah. How come? How come? Other regions are protecting their own. Fulani, they protect their own terrorists. We will be freedom fighters. Igbos will get freedom fighters. Every day, the people that call themselves elders are calling them terrorists. In broad daylight, without shame, without even remorse. Because they are trying to defend our people. If person say, because if they bomb uh, our people shop for Lagos, then go relocate them. 
they no go go market, then go relocate. That one might be terrorism. That one is an act to show that that person is not happy. Wait till na go on for the talk now be how na go take negotiate with ne uh, Yoruba elders. May they know they allow their youth born Igbo business. Now wait till na for the talk now. If to say on they represent our people. But the way they talk, it's obviously they are enemies of Ndibo. And these people are few. And the governors are using them. Now so I see them all. I don't know as you take see this thing while they talk now. The other day, now so then they there, full and he placed bounty on Nam the Kano. Before you know it, they went ahead to kidnap him. Oh, Hannes Ndibo, what have you done? Your son is in DSS custody. Your son is not a thief. He's not a terrorist. Your brother, make I know, no, make I know talk so now. I no be a father. Una be criminal brothers. Una brother nam the cano e de DSS. All of una na ma don't see pata pata na ne de talk am again. Simon e ba wona wa me de arrest. What you do na? What you do? Una never see say finish government. They don't call up, ask some question and answer them. She be na still their country is still that guy still there. She be he's moving freely. Una be re zoological republic. Una own mumu don't do. Mumu, mumu, mumu. Na mumu too much. Something that you are running, you say is a country. It's a banana republic. We are truth is lies, lies, truth. We are light is darkness, darkness, light. God forbid. And you are supporting evil. You are validating what is not working for you. Eh? Which kind thing be this one? Who send on a self? Who na they represent? It is high time Igbo youth look into this on and Zendebo. They will resolve that how? Dissolve it. They will dissolve it. If there is anything like Igbo elders, then we will go know from there. But this particular name on and Zendebo is not working for Ndebo. They are for their own selfish interests. Unfortunately, that's who they are and what they are doing. I go on one make a drop on a comment. This is why they speak pigeon, they speak English, they speak Igbo. He, he, so he pay me, Richo. Oh. He pay me. Oh. Yeah? Thank you very much for following us up to this point. Um, we say may God bless you and answer your prayers. Thank you. Amen.